Hello everyone, Steve Rail with West Central Distribution. I'm standing in a soybean field, June 16th, and I want to talk to you about some of the opportunities and also some of the concerns involved with use of starter fertilizers in furrow on, uh, on susceptible crops. This particular uh, producer was uh, planting corn and switched over to soybeans and had some starter fertilizer that he had been using in his corn and knew of the opportunities that could be uh, obtained when using a starter fertilizer on soybeans to achieve um, higher yields. But in this case, what he did is he went into the soybean field utilizing the same fertilizer that he had been using in his corn and also at the same fertilizer rate in furrow on his soybeans. Of course, soybeans being a far more susceptible crop to injury relating to salt indexes of fertilizers, that can be a little bit dangerous. So I'm gonna show you a couple of rows here. I'm gonna show you the untreated where he ran out of the starter fertilizer and then the adjacent row where he was using the corn rate of starter fertilizer, okay? So here it would be a picture from the top of the row where no fertilizer was used. And then coming back on this side is the row where he was using the corn fertilizer, starter fertilizer rate. Now I'm gonna stop here, because here are a couple of plants that I dug up. As you can see, the roots are a little bit brown. That means that we have pulled some moisture out of those roots. That's what salt indexes do. When we have high ranges of salt in some of these susceptible crops, that's a concentration gradient and water needs to try, it, it tries to get water to equalize that gradient. When it can't get enough from the soil, it will steal from the roots and susceptible crops can be damaged. Soybeans have huge potential for use with starter fertilizers, but we need to take into account their index and their analysis. Uh, in these cases, uh, in this particular case, I should say the, uh, the whole process was exacerbated by the fact that this is a good farmer who wanted to get good weed control and used a PPO herbicide. So on the side where the, there was no starter fertilizer, you can still see a little influence of the PPO herbicide. But on the starter side where we already had salt index, it, it, was, it exacerbated the problem and made it much more acute. There are starter fertilizers on the market for soybeans. West Central has a good starter fertilizer in soy shot. It's a 01010. Has the effective chelate levisol that's found in other um, products that West Central sells, such as Soy Green and Redline. This particular starter fertilizer would be an excellent choice for soybeans because of its relatively low salt index, allowing for the benefits of starter fertilizer without the risk of the starter fertilizer injury. This is Steve Rail, June 16th, uh, 2017, signing off. Till next time, thank you.